Well, you know, we've been spending a lot of time in the Eastern Cape here. And we've gone around and we've been in the townships, in the more outlying towns. I've just come back from Henke. And we've been interacting with thousands of people. Quite honestly, we've, we've shook, shaken hands and hugged a lot of people and had meetings and, uh, where people have also had an opportunity to ask questions. By and large, our people are more concerned about issues that impact on their lives, on local government, on delivery, where, and on jobs, and uh, how, what we're we going to do to improve their houses that may be having cracks and falling apart, and uh, how, when and how we're going to build houses, uh, water reticulation, toilets, giving them sides, and as far as I'm concerned, in the main, that's what people have been raising. Honestly, not a single one, not even a single one, has raised the issue of the Constitutional Court. And if they had, I would tell you. Uh, but they haven't raised that. And in many ways, our people have also been filled with a lot of hope as they've been hearing our message, where we've been telling them that we are here to consolidate our position. We had weaknesses in our municipality here and that's why we brought uh, Denny Jordan to be our mayor here and he has started doing really wonderful things, correcting the mistakes of the past, getting rid of corruption, focusing more on delivery issues. And that is what we've been telling people. And with that, uh, they've been having a lot of hope and they've been saying to us, please get on and do the work because our hopes are pinned on you as the ANC and its leadership. So I leave many of the communities here really feeling confident. Are we certain of victory in this uh, metro? I am more than convinced that we are certain of victory. The people are solidly behind the ANC I have not heard a single disgruntlement. And I think where there is disgruntlement would be maybe in the offices of the DA.